everybody, it's Craster Reborns. I am just back from the my hair painting class at the Rose Doll Show. So I just wanted to show off a few things. This is the uh, rose bag that I picked up while I was there. It's a gorgeous canvas bag, and I love this clasp in the shape of a rose. Some of these things are from my class, and some are in the rose bag. So this came from my class that I took. Keep calm and paint dolls. Nice and handy. Actually, let's spread it out like that. And then, ah, it's not gonna stay on my table. Um, and then they also gave me a, a free shopping bag from Bountiful Baby. And I said, hey, this, this isn't big enough for a baby. <laughs> but um, anyway, I also got a free calendar and this has all the pictures of all the babies um, that were used for the different prototypes I'm not prototypes um, real borns this year and then I got a rose water bottle this is beautiful a shade of pink and I got the newest uh, kit by Bountiful Baby. This is the Adeline kit. There's two special kits for the Rose doll show. There she is. She's got two little fists. So that's super exciting because I really wanted um, an open-eyed newborn so that she will be perfect for that. Uh, I got some, I think these are preemie size. They look really small, but that's great. I love these creamy sized diapers, a little comb. Let's see, what's this? Oh, I think it's a no hole nipple bottle. This is what they gave out last year too. And a, I don't know if you can see that. Are we focusing? Camera, I don't know. Oh, it's a, like a, I don't know if you can tell, but it like moves. Yeah, and this is one of those tiny no hold nipples, nipple bottles. And this is from Little Sprouts Nursery, a little headband. That's pretty. They had the cutest onesies at the show. Um, it was funny, they were more than the adult t-shirts, but they were um, little bodysuits that were gray, and then they had little raglan sleeves with roses on it. They were gorgeous. And these are from Denise Pratt. Tiny little socks, also in there. This is my armband for the show. I picked up my, uh, my show tickets. And from my painting class, I got a palette. Um, and I got a set of brushes um, that were really nice. But I set them to the side because they are... Um, once you use brushes for Genesis, you can't use them for air dry paints. Um, but I have to say, after taking this class in hair painting, I kind of got converted to Gen Genesis. Um, it was so cool how it has just so much open time that you can play with. Um, but <laughs> we'll wait and see if I'm going to make that transition. Um, but the class I took, if you are ever wondering if a Rose Doll Show class is any good, it is. I took pa um, hair painting with Yvonne Nather, 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 excuse me, and she was just so wonderful. Not only a fabulous artist, but a, just a nice, wonderful person and an excellent teacher. I mean, you expect the person teaching the class to be a great artist, but when they're also an amazing teacher. Um, we just learned so much. Um, there were people in that class of all ability levels. So if you're wondering, oh, well, you know, I've, I've only painted a couple of reborns before. Will I get a lot out of the class? Yes, you will. Or you may be thinking the opposite. I have been reborning for years and years and years, and I don't need to learn anything. Yes, you can. Um, there were people there who were um, having aha moments all the time who'd been reborning um, forever. And I'm going to show you my, my baby in just a second. But we got this beautiful booklet that um, Yvonne put together and she signed our books. Um, and this also had a bunch of information about skin tone layers, talked about all the layers that she used. 
and then in the back were practice um, sketches and talked about brushes and again lots of inspiration from her beautifully painted babies and then had all the the pictures and uh, I took so many notes that I took those uh, separately and um, I just loved it so much that I actually went and bought brushes that were similar to what she was using for the class that I didn't have and uh, these are going to be for my air dry paints. Um, if you are uh, going there for the first time, there is a Michael store that's literally right next door to the Davis Conference Center. So if you get super excited about, you know, something that you learn in a class or you get talking with an artist and they use a certain kind of brush or a certain kind of paint or whatever, you can just walk over to Michael's and get something. Um, my husband drove me there and he was so nice to just sit and wait all day. And there's, I also will tell you, there's a great Mongolian barbecue all you can eat that's right next to that. So that's where we had dinner. So let me show you the doll that I finished. Now her head is not attached yet because I had to come home and glue her pacifier in. So, um, but here she is. She is the Ashley Awake kit. And I hope I don't freak you out too much because remember her head's not attached. But I did want to show you because I am so proud of my painting. So this is my painted hair from Yvonne's class. And I have to say, like I said, she was an amazing artist and teacher. Um, she spent time individually with each one of us, um, walking us through the steps and demonstrating and um, doing it on the heads that we had brought. And this just absolutely came out far beyond my wildest dreams of what I thought it was going to come out. Um, this baby is absolutely gorgeous now, um, and as soon as her pacifier dries and I have some time to um, take her picture, um, she is going to be for sale on my Facebook page and here on YouTube. Um, she is a preemie size doll. Um, I believe she's 16 or 17 inches, I forget. I love how she has one straight leg and one bent leg. Um, I don't have a name for her yet, so if you guys can come up with a name, that would be awesome. So look for her to be coming soon to uh, to YouTube and Facebook. So thanks for tuning in today. I uh, am taking the day off tomorrow, um, and then Friday I'm going to be going back to the show floor, so I'll be showing you... Um, giving you kind of a walkthrough um not of the whole of the whole show because i'm really going to this as a collector and i have some definite ideas of things that i want so uh i will be sharing that with you thanks a lot for tuning in today to tfn ta-ta for now